Warning, this game contains flashing lights and imagery that may trigger seizures in individuals with photosensitive epilepsy. Viewer discretion is advised. Uh, got it. I have not turned off my light, but I can't be asked to do so, so I'm not. Because I have only just sat down. Anyway, welcome to the Lancaster Leak Entity Exam. I was meant to play this game ages ago, so whenever this game came out, I've had a doubt since, and I've completely and utterly forgotten to record it until I was sat down and then I was just like, huh, what do I record? Because I was finding. I was struggling to find things to record, honestly, and then I was like, oh yeah, I have this game that I've had for months. But anyway, yeah, um, I have played the other games, um, and I've probably put the, uh, what's it called, playlists, that's what I was looking for, in the uh, description, hopefully, if I put it into a playlist. If not, I will make a playlist. Anyway, let's stop babbling, and let's go. We are getting the feeling that you aren't talk taking us seriously. Uh, okay. No acknowledgement of the missing Valier or the tapes we're leaking. I did not read that right, but sure. This time we decided to reveal something a little bit closer to home. An old, but if she isn't released. Maybe the next leak will show how useless your training is. This is, uh, what? Uh, this is, uh, okay, never mind. I was going to read that. ERD, Entity Research Department. Logo news, yeah? Do I do a thing? I don't know. Oh. I actually have to type it. Also, I do apologise if, like, my reading skills are worse than usual. Because, um... I don't know where I put my glasses. Uh... That'll do. I really hope I don't have to remember that, actually. I just slap my keyboard and hope for the best. Uh, required learning modules and practice quizzes. Okay. 79 degrees... Should be less degrees and not Fahrenheit. Probably Fahrenheit. Um, it's 1991. Anyway, uh, start with number one, I guess, or this one, even. Uh, Round ERD research, there has been one constant. I need to turn up my headphones, that's what I need to do. Entities who possess human characteristics are the most violent, deceptive, and are the greatest threat to public security. Oh. Bye voice, I nice knowing you. It is imperative <laughs> that agents have the skills to not only detect potential threats, but fast. Don't worry, my observatory skills are... BRD has not found the one-year agent I mean, fatality great. rate goes down from 34.7 per 100 to 26.2 per 100 after taking this module and being proficient in this skill. Okay. Using your cursor, click on the face in the image in the allotted time. Distractions may be employed. Okay. I'm ready. Begin. You haven't shown me anything yet, bud. Normal. I, wait, was I supposed to be clicking if it wasn't normal? I, I'm just clicking away, I don't actually know what I'm doing. Oh. I, was I supposed to click that? I, <laughs> I should have listened. That's just a woman with the freaky mask who's probably belongs to that. That's. I'm just clicking away. No. Oh. Ugh. I just heard a noise in my room coming from my open window. I don't... Did I miss that? That's just the back rooms. Ugh. That one came with audio. That wasn't in the description. <laughs> uh... My heart started racing out of nowhere, apparently. Uh, 
Gee, I hope these are over soon. Uh oh. I thought I clicked, but apparently not. Oh my. <laughs> I did actually click that, I think. Well, that's hardly fair. 16 out of 19 pass. Is that good? Uh, I wonder if you can... Because I clearly did misclick, obviously. I don't know. Maybe I've played it backwards and editing. I have no idea. 1 out of 6 complete. Um, I'm going to shut my curtain and close my window. Because for some reason I feel like somebody's looking at me through my window. And I keep looking over at it and getting distracted. So I'm going to close that. Right out. That's that done. Uh, there was no creepy things looking at me in my back alley. Um, <laughs> um, or at least not what I saw. Anyway, situation training. That sounds already a great start. This module has been created to address and rectify observed deviations from established protocols, reaffirming the essential principles that all ERD agents are expected to adhere to consistently. Lesson 1. CERT. Right. CERT stands for Calmly Collect Evidence. Eliminate threats. Okay. Run away. <laughs> and terminate self. Okay. <laughs> Given an interaction with an entity, these are the order of actions an agent will take during expulsion. I don't want to be an agent anymore. Of course, that's what is we data do. collection, as research remains the top priority of the RD. Second, okay. eliminate the threat, unless such entity is on the preservation list. A dead entity can be studied, a dead agent cannot. If okay. fighting back is futile, agents should run. If running is futile, agents should terminate themselves. Okay. Let us look at an example, where an agent didn't follow the principles of CERT. Okay. I'm gonna get my hand on the mouse just in case. In 1989, oh. Agent Redacted was collecting data on Entity E59 Skinwalker. Suddenly cornered, Agent Redacted fired all 12 shots of his service pistol into oh. Entity. With no bullets left, Redacted was subjected to Entity E59 as ref. Remember to search, remember to keep an extra round. Okay. This video is another example. Think, following the values of search, what would you do? I'm not retaining information very well today. Um, what? Uh, is this just a video? I think so. Oh. Hello. Good evening. There was definitely a thing in there. Uh. Oh yeah, this is a great idea. Best. Oh! Um. <laughs> oh no, the floating PNG is coming to get you. Whatever you sure you do. Anything but the floating PNG. Lesson 2 Do's and Don'ts. Improvements we need in the RD. Alright. <laughs> to interact with entities, if new data can be collected. Don't risk losing obtained data by interacting too much. Do help co-workers gather data. Okay, so Don't remember become this friends issue. with co-workers. Do terminate co-workers who leak data. Don't hesitate. Explain later. Uh, was that the last one the same thing? Protocol. This is all happening very fast, and my tiny little pea brain can't keep up. I'm not gonna lie, yourself, this is going through one ear and out the other. And data um. <laughs> Assisting civilians is strictly forbidden, unless stated otherwise in mission protocol. Right. Reminder, the punishment for deviation is termination. Great. In 1990, Agent Redacted was on a mission studying an entity. The entity was located at Agent Redacted's house. Agent Redacted tried and successfully saved his wife. Agent Redacted nice didn't follow protocol and both him and his wife were terminated. Ah. Well, they're gone. This concludes the refresher. We will not remind about these topics again. 
Be your supervisor <laughs> if you have questions. But good thing it takes me once to retain information. A I say that with booming with confidence. About these topics will now commence. Uh oh. You don't know. No, I was gonna say I'm gonna fail this, but no, we're gonna we're gonna put our heads to this. We're gonna, we're gonna try to survive. Uh, an NC has killed your partner, but is no longer exhibiting hostile behavior. What should you do? Uh, collect evidence. Wait. Okay. I think I've got this down. I think. Hi. After a mission, an entity knowingly followed you home. You have tried to shoot at the entity, but your efforts are futile. You are cornered in your room. What should you do? Terminate itself, correct. You are carrying newly discovered data and an entity. You hear your partner upstairs cry for help. You do not know you could probably neutralize the threat attacking you. What should you do? Right now, this is where difficulties happen. Because my instinct is to sh charge up the fucking stairs and shoot the shit out of whatever the fuck is fucking with my partner. But, knowing this situation, it's either... It's either... Is it collect evidence or run away? Oh, I say collect evidence. I, but I want to eliminate the threat. Fuck. Uh, do not risk losing the data collected. Oh, that's your unsettling. You do not, uh, you have a do not interfere order on mission studying an entity. The entity is killing civilians, one, uh, one of which is your friend. You have been given a weapon strong enough to neutralize the entity. What should you do? Help friends recover your friend's death. Uh, help. Uh, okay. <laughs> I've got one right so far. <laughs> what I'm noticing with this test is just do the opposite of what you actually would do. So get the helping person part of your brain, tuck that away under a rug for a minute. Uh, you overheard a superior talking about a plan leak data from ERD. You are worried that you will be in trouble for solving the issue. What should you do? Uh, do nothing, they probably know something you don't. Terminate your boss. Recall the conversation and report to your boss. I'm gonna do that all. Well. <laughs> I didn't even get to the jump scare. I didn't even get to the jump scare, sorry, because I was just that shit. Good to know. <laughs> Let's try that again with, uh, you know, less being... Well, it's just say co complete it. You know what? No, we're gonna go off it. We're gonna go off and try to complete it. Ah, right, if you failed it, that that's an issue. Um, well, I didn't want to live anyway. Due to its emergence as one of the most common and dangerous entities, special training on doppelganger detection was created. Originally thought to be its own entity type, the doppelganger is rather a class of entities who visually and audibly mimic humans. Great. Doppelgangers can be detected from their abnormal features. The most common attributes to look for are loose skin, missing features, and incorrect features. Further oh, yeah. classification of the bell yeah, yeah. can be made by observing the abnormal features. Loose for skin example, could just be genetics, though. Always have loose skin. However, and or age, but I suppose just your ear looks all different. Different. Looked it off, actually, never mind. I have no idea what you last said, because I was too busy flying my guns, I do apologise. Click on the doppelganger amongst the humans. Okay. I'm on it, boss. Begin. I hate the anxiety, waiting for it to go. Uh, missing features. Uh, oversized features. Jesus. Uh, yours is a blind dude. Wait, hang on. No, pff, I'll just go with it. You, uh, what? You, uh, that just seemed like a over obese dude. I do not know. You seem unsettling. <laughs> uh, again, like normal people, I'll go with that one, I guess. You. 
You don't seem right. <laughs> At least compared to the other people. Uh, you. That's definitely you. Nobody has an American dad chin other than the guy who's American dad. Uh, shit. Uh, shit. That one. Ugh. Oh, I've been getting it right so far then. doesn't count apparently. Oh, this is making me unnervous. Unnervous? I mean nervous. Oh, Jesus. That one I'll last when I click sync. I need to get one off my screen. <laughs> that just seemed more racist than anything. Doppelganger that is racist. Great, good to know. Um I also for some reason do not trust this fucking screen. Uh it was regular uh Whatever. <laughs> what? His training module is to practice with reaction. It's a dramatic training module, apparently. If Jesus. Something is a friend. Oh. Or a foe. Oh. Answer in the allotted time, else it will be marked incorrect. Roger Dodger, sir. Text to speech, sir. Begin. We're right into this one. There's no messing about with this one. Uh, whoa. Uh, not a threat. I almost clicked threat then. Jesus. Uh, threat. Definitely. Not threatening. Oh, add a little nice doodle. Uh, no threat. Oof. Uh, threat. He's gonna sell my kidneys in a dark web. I mean, not really, because you're in a window. Well, uh, uh, no threat, no threat. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, threat. Uh, not a threat. Definitely a threat. <laughs> uh, threat? Nope. Not a threat. <laughs> Not a shadow of a doubt, burning man. Not a threat. Hey, wasn't that there before? No, definitely a threat. Both of them. They could suck an egg. So the audio had to catch up for a minute. I thought some freaky shit was gonna happen, but apparently not. Nice. <laughs> uh, not a threat. Ah. <laughs> I don't know if that is because it didn't register a click or that generally wasn't a threat. The fucking hell. Back to you two. I thought I missed that one. <laughs> Not a threat. I mean, I would smash that to a million pieces. That's why it wouldn't be a threat. Oh, threat. Hey, 26 out of 30. It's the first one I got green. Must have done something right. Audio transcript. No, that doesn't. No, that doesn't fill me with confidence. I'm gonna have some weird entity lick my earlobe. 
Agents must be able to accurately transcribe audio coming from unusual sources. Okay. Besides being able to detect incoming attacks, agents must document what entities say during encounters, as research remains the number one priority. Sure. Type into the console what you hear, and press enter when complete. Oh, I type like a frickin' sloth though. Begin. Sure thing. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Wait, do I have to type all of that? Look with brown fox jumps over the... <laughs> That's not a dog. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Did you say lazy? The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Was that correct? Do not look behind you. <laughs> I know that one. Oh, fuck off. Freaking step stepping behind me, you bastard. You are weak and replaceable. You're probably right on that one, actually, but. Oh, fuck off. Every time that step goes off. I just want to replace. Look, this isn't funny putting pressure on a dyslexic guy, right? Clap, 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 cloudy with a chance of rain. Cloudy with a chance of rain. That's, that's, hang on. I fat fingered the shit out of that. Chancer? <laughs> Not a chance here. That was right, I guess. Everything is fine. fine, fine, fine. Yeah. That audio is not. Everything is fine. Said the radio man. Who is clearly not a radio man. Is probably a ship. See, 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 see the sun often. What? I don't see, 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 see the sun often. See. Off ten. I have no idea what you mean. <laughs> Don't leave me here. How about? No. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, let's not. I got sorry. Excuse me. That was a mistype. Don't leave me here. I hope that was the right type of here. Get out of my eyes. Kill with my eye. Oops. Not ET. I don't know what he's gonna fucking do. I don't know what he said anyway. Um, Off. That works too, I guess. <laughs> Didn't appreciate that one. Um, I don't know what you said. Let's actually give it a go, so we think I like you. I think that's what she said. I play with you. Sure, it's the only thing I got. Well, don't you forget me? I know that one. Also, I do apologise if I'm a bit not talkative in this bit, because I... I desire you. <laughs> Jesus, lady, there's better ways to say it than that. 
you know, ask me out to dinner or something first, at least, Jesus. Um, you know, might scare me, and I might, uh, I don't know. But just a second, I desire you. Please come back. Now, you see, if you ask people nicely out to dinner, they might not run away if you say I desire you. Don't understand of that because your is peaking. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I probably just whiffed an answer then, actually. Well, I see, I don't know how you would get all of them in that one. Uh. I don't know if I'm mentally prepared to see Entity 101. Well, I mean, it could be just Entity 101 as in, like, Entity 101, you know, like, this is what you do in the case of an Entity, not, you know, uh, a literal entity and its designation is 101 because if that is an S if that is an entity designation 101 and he's got his own section that's pretty horrifying in himself in itself not himself but anyway let's uh, go for it I guess entities are otherworldly beings that humans have been encountering for thousands of years for once was a rare sighting, entities have begun appearing more rapidly through time. Oh, this led to the founding of the Entity Research Department. whoop de day Bit like SCP, really. The RD goal is researching entities to protect the public, but more importantly, finding utility in entities and where they come from. The leading theory of where they come from is backdoors, yet no physical evidence has been found yet. Okay. Maybe because it wasn't of the physical plane that That's it came from. That's where you come in. As right. an agent of ERD, you will be conducting highly confidential research missions to explore the gain of function of entities and finding their origin. This right. brief module will explain how entities are classified and show you the four entities ERD are focusing on in 1992. Okay. Entities are given an ID but are often given a nickname. Some entities are given a class that link them to a family of entities. Entities are classified in three ways, threat level, containment, and utility each rated by five levels. Okay. That's Entity, a lot of information. 549. Oh, Nickname, Shadow People. Class, Doppelganger. Threat, Moderate. Containment, Extreme. Utility, Significant. Shadow people, or night terrors, torment their prey during nights when there is low visibility, often in bedrooms, when the prey is sleeping. Paralyzing their prey during sleep, shadow people will oh, honestly watch from a distance. Demon. It isn't known why shadow people choose to kill, as they will often torment the same subject for many years, but when they do, the victim isn't touched. To the civilian world it seems the subject died in their sleep. 
the research goal this year is finding out how shadow people choose their prey, and if this can be influenced. If so, E549 could be used in advanced interrogation techniques. Okay. Entity, E718. Nickname, Metronic. Class, Machine. Threat, Low. Containment, Easy. Utility, Moderate. Metronics take the form of animatronics, playful figures that appeal to children. Metronics prey on children with no known case of an adult victim. It isn't known where Metronics bring their children prey, however, they are never seen again. Metronics, although dangerous, they are easy to terminate and capture. The past five years, agents of ERD children have been targeted by Metronics and have taken 107 to date. The Whoa. research goal this year is finding why Matronsis are targeting agent children and how to redirect their targeting. I hope I don't have to remember this. E59. Nickname, uh, Skinwalker. Class, Doppelganger. Threat, uh -oh. Severe. Containment, Moderate. Utility, Significant. Skinwalkers are ancient Shapa shifters usually taking the form of animals and uncommonly humans, stealing their skin in the process. Ugh. Skinwalkers are incredibly violent oh, I mean, and when killed leave behind nothing but their body vector. Skinwalkers have a hard time replicating the natural movements of creatures they take control of. Skinwalkers can often be identified by unusual eye size or loose skin. The research goal right. this year is finding a systematic way to identify skinwalkers 99% of the time and finding out defensive measures that can be taken to prevent loss of possession of body. Got it. I think. Entity, E-59. Uh. Nickname, The Rake. That's Class, No. Uh. Threat, <laughs> Moderate. No rakes for me. Moderate. The only rake I want is a garden Utility, rake. Low. After the elimination of the Windigo, a new creature has seemingly taken its place in the Midwest of America and Southern Canada. Oh. Humanoid in shape, the rake has varying size limbs but usually conforms to a white pasty color skin. Rakes hunt at night and humans are their favorite prey. Rakes are susceptible to gunfire, yet are incredibly agile and thus hard to shoot. Oh the dear. research goal this year is finding out the cause of their resurgence and the correlation after the Windigo eradication. Is there a point of taking out entities, if there is always a bigger fish? Very good question. A brief quiz will now begin. Oh dear. Uh... Begin. Sure thing, boss. Oh, I've got to remember the nakes. Uh, nakes? What? I mean names, not nakes. What's a nake? Um, a tronic. Shouldn't be too bad if it's just, uh, uh, Shadow Man. Nope, it was Shadow Walker, I think. It was Shadow something. Uh... Skinwalker. Got it. Uh, uh, I don't actually know. I'm gonna say Rake. I was right. Uh, wait, what the hell? Uh, child agent has been taken away. What should you do? Uh... <laughs> oh dear. Uh, what gives away this entity as a skinwalker? Uh, upwards figure. Uh, should all people kill their pay for half for how long? Oh, I don't actually know. I want to say years. Yes, it was. Uh, Rake has approached you during a mission. You have a service pistol. Okay, it wasn't Terminate self this time. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> uh, the child, uh, and after what should you use? Trader module, you have to learn. Child is at risk of abduction. What should you do? Uh, nothing. Ugh. I wanted to say report, but. Oh, I passed. Yay. Sure, did shift and feel like I passed. Every time this menu loads up, I feel like something's going to happen. Right, now we're on the final exam. I have a funny feeling I'm going to completely whiff this and become dead. But, um, just in case in that inevitability. This was a, was a wonderful time doing this with you guys. And just remember, if you see anything weird in your house, and you shoot at it, and or throw a shovel, or the kitchen sink at it, 
and it doesn't fall down, just remember to terminate yourself. That's not really a great message. Do whatever you want. You can either terminate yourself or die a valiant warrior death. It's completely up to you. <laughs> oh, okay. I hate that. The final exam will now begin. A mixture of content from previous modules. Yep. I'm not very good at tests. Never have been, really. Begin. Oh shit, right into it. If we're gonna say some, some mumble jumble shit, there's a face there. Uh, uh, you. Did you check the latch? Uh, I don't even know if I spelled anything right there. Uh, NCS threatening your appearance, what should you do? Uh, run away. Bollocks. <laughs> I will never get those right. I, uh, not for it. Good thing I'm, I shouldn't become a field agent. Well, I mean, that's probably what Yeah, the one on the right. Okay. Right? Oof. I didn't think I was going to make that one. Oh, uh, you have to. Uh, yes, to uh, threat. Fuck. <laughs> I'd fist fight an animatronic. I wouldn't win, but I'd fist fight it. Degree of defiance and all that shit. Uh, what? Terminate itself. <laughs> it doesn't even speak any English. Terminate itself. That's probably not a good advice to follow. But uh, <laughs> um, no, uh, you're wrong. I didn't even check any other faces. I just saw the top right ones. I know. Uh, correct entity, shadow people, shadow people. No, uh, your co-worker is considered a good friend, seems to be affected by something. You want to save him, but it's your duty to put him down. This example of what? I don't know. Uh... Key. Gosh, there was the other one I knew it was. I hesitated. Are you serious? Apparently I'm a faster typer than I remember, and that's great for a minute. Fuck off. Hi. Um, I mean, hello, sir, not fuck off. Um, that's rather rude of me. Oh, there's a lot of things wrong. Rather sexy though, I must admit. Uh, wait, save children, eliminate threat. Uh, upset. Oh, why would it be upset? Uh, just correct and see. Uh, rake. Easy. I can see a rake from a mile away. Uh, oh shit. Um, shut up, people. Face. That last one I clicked on was too fucking around. Uh, definitely a threat. Fucking take your Ronald McDonald ass and fuck off. Hey, that's actually pretty good. Turn to your supervisor for the next instructions. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Well. Talk about making it personal. Shit. <laughs> um, well, that was the credit screen. Bit interesting. That was a Lancaster leak. Well. Um, I'm going to go find myself a nice bulletproof bunker, like, well, more than that, entity resistant bunker, and, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and hopefully I'll see you in whatever the hell comes up next, but judging by that end message, this could be my last video. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, 
see you whatever the ha whatever the hell comes up next hopefully um have a good one